Hi friends, here in this video, I will be explaining the concept of buoyancy and center of buoyancy. Buoyancy basically means flotation. When we have a body which is submerged in a liquid, I am taking an example of water. When it is submerged in water, in that case, there is first of all the weight of the body which would be acting on the water and equal amount of water would be displaced. That is, whatever is the weight of the body, that same amount of weight of liquid will be displaced by the body and due to that, there would be a force which would be acting in an upward direction which will try to lift that body and that force is called as a buoyancy force also called as the flotation force so for that here i'll draw a diagram here there is a rectangular block of height capital h and the width is small b then since i have considered a rectangular block its centroid would be exactly at the half of this height that is at h by 2 distance next I am considering this rectangular block to be submerged in water it is submerged in water and up to a depth of small h so small h is the height up to which it is submerged and now i would be taking the half of this height where the center of buoyancy would be there so the half of this would be it is this point b acting at h by 2 half of the submerged height now from this point g the weight of the fluid would be acting in the downward direction along the centroid or we can say center of gravity here the weight of this block is acting and that weight was, would be mass into acceleration due to gravity and equal to this weight the water is displaced by an equal amount of this weight and due to that there is a force acting in the upward direction because of that displaced water and that force is called as the buoyancy force denoted by f suffix b acting at point b which is called as the center of buoyancy and due to this upward force the body or the block would be pushed upward and it would try to float so this is the concept which is used in case of ships and vessels which travel in the ocean that is we are using the concept of buoyancy and as i have explained this b or the center of buoyancy is the point where the buoyancy force acts and how to get that we have to take half of the height of the submerged liquid and the amount of water which is displaced by this vessel is equal to the weight of the block or the weight of this vessel so in short and in this case the equilibrium would be maintained and the body would be stable so in short that was an explanation of buoyancy and center of buoyancy at the end if you'll find my videos helpful you can like share comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.